Charles Food. I will like them. Did you like it the food pack school, Lou? Yeah, I liked it a lot. It was more fun than I could have remembered. Okay, Skilly, you had the your fun, but you were the still in danger, and I bet your you, your real family and friends are knowing this truth so much. As as much as you have fun if you if to say this, Skilly, you can't. You still have an actual friend and family who are waiting on your world. So I think it's actually time to go to bed and go find the doctor the pet at the time of the and ask for a ride. It's a perfect day, but you can't stay right after all. If we're about those time around these her holds true something to come from another universe here. It stands to reason in this fruit this universe. This firefly shoot is stuck in your universe. And I doubt she'll so well equipped to the steel with the crazy stuff that's happening here. Okay. So I get what you're saying. My my world has ended a pair was a pair and ended apparently. And I don't know what happened to it, but was it all my fault? I'm not a defender of a course you're like Twilight and a friend. Sure, I've been called a pillar point or whatever, and I can kind of sell some magic, but that doesn't mean I, I mean I was the savior of this universe or anything. No, this end of the world, huh? Was well, supposed to be a downside somewhere. Would it be so long if I just wanted to stay here? Think someday you're thinking that kid. Thoughts like that, you're going to let the whole universe be destroyed. All of our asses, and how did you survive? Starlight, how did you get in here? Oh, hey, Starlight, how long have you been here? You got sent here by anomalies as well, just to find enough to, try, to, to, enough to travel to the other at all. I can imagine Starlight sitting under the window for hours, waiting for Scoots to come back to make cool or have an appearance. Some way you did by using magic to afford being enraged and and rewritten. Well, you did it a lot more unintentionally than I did. What? I don't even know what you're talking about. Hell, I won't remember anyway, and that's not the point right now. And thus, an explosion train arrives. Hey, Charlie, with sudden appearance that will cause heart attacks, paralysis. I assume it's in less than time. What is important right now is fixing the timeline. And I can't do without your help. Look, I don't know what you want from me. I know this isn't my normal wo world, but it's amazing here. What's wrong with me staying here? It's not my job to save Equestria. Nothing would change if I stayed here. You really don't know what's going on here, or how important you are. Of course I don't. Everything is just kind of happening, and I'm stuck in the middle of all of it. Well, here's the important part you need to understand. This isn't a different dimension like one of ours. Those terminal worlds you get messages from a visit. This is an ultimate timeline caused by the universe being destroyed. And the universe is STILL being destroyed. If we don't do anything soon about it, the soul little paradise of yours it will be destroyed too with everyone in it, including you. He's just supposed to this anonymous ass something that doesn't read it all. And just why exactly should I just believe you? Well, I've had enough rumors. Sorry by now. Your whole thing is manipulating ponies. You tricked an entire vi village into giving up their talents. You tried to change the time to punish Twilight. Then you manipulated Tumbleablog to try to kill her. Then you manipulated me into freezing you from your own prison. You have given me no reason to trust you. Huh? I didn't, I didn't know that you know my legacy. I'm not on it. Still, you're worried you're justified at least. Come here and look out the window. Look past the clouds at Equestria down there. Those time disorders look familiar to you, don't they? I really don't do wish this was one of, our, of my schemes, but no. The universe is at stake here, Scoots, and I really do need your help to save it.